it was really shit. The boys need to wake the fuck up and win some games. Bernadeschi and Insigne are only good players. There, there's nothing to laugh about. We haven't won since May, bro. This is Fan First Network. Tough loss, not the outcome we wanted. What are your thoughts on the game? It was really shit. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, it's it's disappointing to see us only want to fight for it when there's like 10 minutes left. Like we were on the back foot the whole game from the first half, like from the first moments of the game. We just looked like we didn't want it. N n uh, no control of possession, nothing whatsoever. It was it was really disappointing, and we got killed out wide, absolutely killed. And the difference from defending out wide is night and day. Orlando was. Orlando handled it well. We handled it like we were fucking Sunday League. Fucking horseshit. Uh, officiating was terrible. Uh, pathetic to the city of Toronto. Honestly, just a fucking joke overall. You know, just terrible. Honestly, Toronto FC did not look at themselves. It's really showing that missing the players is costing us big time. But also, the players need to step up and realize there's only so many times we can point the finger. We still have a good thing going on, but. Um we just got to be more consistent. That first half was complete garbage. I've never seen anything like that. No pressure. We were not doing anything whatsoever. Uh, we're not from here. But we're from London. But yeah, it's a lot of, lot of possession, no goals, no creativity. You know, I'm used to seeing creative football, tiki-taka, but nothing. I, there was nothing there, yeah? Dude, honestly, like, we, we didn't want it in the first half at all. Like, we scored so early in. Second half, we had so many chances, and we just didn't make anything out of it, bro. It's pretty disappointing, I can't lie. All the players were just lazy. They were not playing their top. But you know what? It's a loss. We we move on. I'd say it is what it is, I guess. It is what it is. Absolutely fucking ostrich manure. That was like the worst thing I've ever watched in my entire life. We literally we were at a game. Uh, the one against Nashville, we did the same thing. We bottled it. Terrible defending, terrible offense. And let's get some guys in here that actually want to try. Not in Senya, not in Senya, even though I'm from Italy, not in Senya. Yes. We haven't won a game since May 21st, right? May 21st, it's July right now. Yeah. What are your thoughts on that? What do you think needs to change moving forward? Honestly, that's fucking horse shit. The team needs to wake up. I know we took some big losses with guys going to Copa America. But end of the day, you know, you still got games to play. You still got to put in your best effort. And there's only so much slack you can get. But end of the day, you gotta win games to get a championship. The defenders that are like able to play, it, it's just not going well. I think when Cervania ends up coming back, maybe a, maybe a midfield diamond, maybe a, maybe a, maybe a diamond in the midfield with Davy Flores sitting a bit further back, because he's a rock back there, and he's what's really carrying the midfield right now. Not enough quality players, to be honest. If I'm being real, so just need more quality players. Bring them in. Yeah, I grew the striker looked dead. Fuck you, no, the striker looked dead. <laughs> Bernadeschi was the only good player. Asinye, he was quiet. No quality in it. Uh, I think we just need to play the fucking sport. Uh, I come, I'm come, i here to play, I come here to watch football and I'm watching like ballet. This is like one of the, this is just disgraceful. This is just terrible. It's like a disgrace to Toronto. I think Drake's been betting on us too much and we got cursed. And like, I bet it like at least $500, man. I'm down the drain. Like, I have, I'm broke. Like, I have nothing to do. Like. I don't even know why I'm here watching this match. Like, it's a, it's an addiction, man. Like, don't bet on TFC. That's the moral of the story. Just don't bet on TFC, bro. If you, if you guys were the coach, if you guys were John Herdman, what would you tell the team uh, for the rest of the season? I think, I think there's guys in this team, especially a little short Italian, that feels like he, that he can do whatever he wants. And I feel like Herdman needs to kind of look at him and tell him, like, hey, like, your spot here isn't guaranteed. Yeah, we're paying you a lot of money, but. Doesn't mean we have to play you. So, I just because you're selling jerseys doesn't mean you get to play exactly. on the Exactly. One of the top selling jerseys in the MLS, but you're not doing anything on the field. So I don't know what to really, what to really say to him. I say you guys got to man the fuck up. It's just, it's embarrassing. Like, sure, we're better than last year, but it's not last year. That's in the past. We got to move forward. We got to keep fucking. We we're TFC, man. We're the only Canadian team that's won a fucking MLS Cup. We need to fucking step it up. We need to step it up. We need a, we need a show that we're the fucking leaders of Canada when it comes to soccer. Honestly, I told the boys to wake the fuck up. Like, this isn't no preseason. This isn't no Canadian Cup. This is the MLS. We're here to win championships. It's the real deal, right? It's the real deal. We haven't won it since 2017. We're here to take it back. We're the only Canadian team to win a championship. We gotta bring it back. We gotta show Canada who we are again.
Yeah, yeah, yo, I, I'd switch up the mentality, man. Like, I remember during halftime, they were running Rondo, and they were, like, laughing and shit. Like, oh, yeah. dude, we got to switch it up. There, there's nothing to laugh about. We haven't won since May, bro. Don't laugh during Rondo, bro. The whole, the whole mentality needs to change, bro. Like, the coach needs to be more tough. I like Herdman. I really like him. But, dude, we, we can't give you, like, this long time. Yo, we'll give you a couple of months. But, man, you got to switch it, bro. You got to switch it, man. Come on, let's go. Some players to fight. You need to fight for each other, innit? You can't be losing the ball head down. You gotta fucking win it back. Go put in some challenges. Get the crowd hyped, crowd hyped up. And this is Fan First Network.